Yeah, Bob. I was watching Scooby-Doo the other day, and I was wondering... Whoa, whoa, you, you were watching Scooby-Doo? Yeah. What are you, five? No, I'm 37. <laughs> if I was five, I'd be much smaller. Yeah, okay, anyway, you were watching Scooby-Doo. Yeah, and I was wondering, how come they're still scared of monsters? What? What do you mean? Well, every time they go to a haunted house and they see a ghost or a monster or whatever, it always turns out to be an old guy wearing a mask. Yeah? Well, can't they see there's a pattern here? I mean, why are they still scared when they see monsters? I don't know, because it's a dumb cartoon. And why is Shaggy still with this group? I mean, he's obviously terrified of ghosts. Why doesn't he just stay home? And, and is it their job? Because if it is, who pays them? Or is it a hobby? I don't know, alright? It's just a dumb cartoon. Hey Pete. Yeah, Bob. The episode I was watching happened to feature Scrappy-Doo Puppy. Scrappy-Doo Puppy? Yeah, the little dog there. Oh, I hate that little dog. Aw, oh, he's cute. Anyways, there's one thing about Scrappy-Doo I find confusing. Like, you see, for years, I thought Scooby-Doo was a pretty smart dog, you know? Like, I mean, uh, he can even talk a little bit. He can go like, uh, Rooby-Doo, or, uh, Hey, Reggie, which is pretty smart for a dog. I can't believe I'm having this conversation. And then, along comes his nephew, Scrappy-Doo Puppy, and he can speak like perfect English. He's like, Hey, Scoob, let's get out of here! I mean, uh, turns out Scooby-Doo's retarded or something. I'll tell you who else is retarded. It... it shattered my view of Scoob, you know? Listen, forget about it, alright? It's just a dumb, stupid cartoon. You shouldn't watch it. Nah, I'm not gonna watch it anymore. Good, because it's too stupid? No, it's too scary.